go see Addy, get this arm fixed up. Can't let it get infected. We know what that means. I can't do this anymore. It's okay, I'm fine. What was going on? I'm a goddamn veterinarian. I went to school to cure colic and heaves and hoof diseases. This like a fucking hoof to you. Addy, no, Addy. you saw what happened to Boozer. I can't do this. Hey, shh. Addy. So many wounded. Addy. And so many dying. Addy. Deacon, I am not a doctor. Okay, maybe not. But you're all we got. So Addy's not a doctor, huh? Okay, so you're not a doctor and you still saved Boozer's life. That's gotta count for something. Hey, Deke. So I wanna go check on the explosives to make sure, you know, the Rippers didn't steal them and then I went to Schizo's cabin to check on the deck cords, but I should've just come straight here and saved some time. Get the hell out of here, Ricky. Guess we can go blow up that cave, right? I'll come with you. When I was a kid, my dad found a rat's nest underneath one of our sheds. You want to know what he did? Can't even guess. Well, I waited till morning. They'd all be asleep. He laid a piece of plywood over the hole and told me to go get the garden hose. And he said to me, I never forget what he said to me. He said the best way to kill a rat's nest is to drown him. You can blow up the reservoir above the camp? Oh, that's an idea. Deacon, you can't. They want to rest in De peace. I'm going to help them out. Deacon, you can't do that. Why is that? Because Iron Mike? This is some fucking treaty. You know, I want to cut Schizo's throat, but he's right about one thing. Carlos ain't gonna stop, Rippers ain't gonna stop, and you know it. Are you sure this isn't personal? Fuck yeah, it's personal. Boozer, I'm heading to the gate. You ready? Way ahead of you, brother. Okay, I'm almost there. Nice rifle. Yeah, a little present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. He'll be there. <laughs> that goddamn Schizo. So what are we gonna do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not. All right, so what's the plan? I know the area pretty well. Sarah, uh, she worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Carter a ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself, he's taking over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now, we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on a hill? Yeah, yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the Ripper compound to take out most of his men. And if Jesse survives, he won't see us coming. You got it. Now we just gotta figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. You just 
hang on. better. Right, come on. We gotta finish this. Right behind you. south from here. Following you. easy. Nope. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask him if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing them the fuck up. Boozer. Look, you stay up here with Skizzo's rifle and keep him off me while I set the charges. Oh, ho hold on. Look, I got this. Not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We're doing this? Yeah. <laughs> 